everybody and happy Thursday. I am back with another brand new story. This book is What If Pig? It's written by Lindsay Hunter and it's published by HarperCollins. And we want to thank them for allowing us to read this book to you today. So let's find out what this book is all about. And what do we see here? Very first picture. What do you think this is? Do you have any thoughts? It looks like a mouse with a balloon. Okay. What if pig? What if you had a friend like pig? Hello. What if he was the nicest pig you've ever met? What if he was incredibly kind, fabulously fun, and endlessly generous? But it's your favorite. What did he do? He just gave his donut to Mouse. Do you have any friends like that? What if you felt pretty lucky to have a friend like Pig? That's how Mouse felt. In fact, that's how everyone felt about Pig. Look at all those friends. Look at all of those friends that think that about Pig. Pig was so kind and so generous and so much fun that he had a brilliant idea. What if I throw a party? Does that sound like fun? Well, what's Pig going to have to do? He needs a party checklist. So we need decorations, snacks on sticks, no sausages. We need some hats. We need cake and donuts. We need tunes and we need to make some fancy invitations and games and prizes. All right. I don't know about you, but I think I want to go to Pig's party. What do you think? Ben, sounds like a good party. Charlie, would you like to go to the party? Sounds pretty awesome. Pig's party was sure to be the talk of the town. But what if Pig had a secret? And he's inviting all these people like Bear and Squirrel and Vera and Uncle Potato and Duck. Look at all those invitations. But what's Pig's secret? Pig was a tremendous worrier a porky panicker, a proper nervous Nelly. What if I've made a terrible mistake? Do any of you out there worry a lot? What if a ferocious lion eats all of the invitations? Or worse? Do you think that could happen? Or what if he eats all the guests? Oh my goodness, I don't think that could happen. What if everyone gets stuck in a massive blizzard? What if nobody comes? Or worse? Uh-oh, what do you think or worse is? What if everybody comes and has an absolutely awful time? What was he thinking? Lame. Ugh, Trevor had a chocolate fountain and an ice sculpture. Do you think this could happen? What if, 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 what if no one really likes me at all? Poor pig. I know. What if I cancel the party? Tell everyone I'm sick, go to bed, and never leave the house. Okay, pig, if you're sure, what if we go for a little walk? What if we go for a little walk? Let's get out of the house. Well, I know if I worry sometimes, going for a walk makes me feel better. We know that it makes Charlie feel better. He loves walks. Mouse, what if I always feel sad? What if I always feel 
it feel sad. Don't worry, pig. Things don't stay gray for very long. Surprise! Look at all those people. Surprise, they threw him a surprise party. They threw pig a surprise party. Have you ever had one of those? Maybe we're more alike than we think. I worry that nobody can tell I'm a horse. My ears are too small. That's elephants. I worry that I look silly. We're scared of water. What if we all talked about our worries? I'm slow. I'm not even outdoorsy. I get really nervous around cats. Me too. Mousy, yay. Look at that. The dog gets nervous around cats. All right. We all know this. Murphy and Charlie get very nervous around cats. Guess what? And if you talk about it, maybe you do realize that a lot of you have the same worries. And how, how silly is that? A bear who isn't even outdoorsy. Pretty silly. Mouse, what if I have the kindest, most generous and fun friends a pig could meet? Yes, pig. And I think Pig had the kindest, most generous friends. What do you think? The end. I would love to know what you think about this story. So please let us know on our Instagram page. And I'm gonna be back on Tuesday, believe it or not, with the first story about fall. I can't wait to share it with you. It's another brand new book. So until then, I hope everyone has a great weekend. Come in, check these books out of the library, and you can have a lot of fun reading them. We also have an activity guide that goes with this book. So until then, have a great rest of your week. Bye for now.